Well, guys, let's see what we got in this package today. I believe it's from XR only for the dual purpose, man. Ooh, what kind of good shit do we got in here? Oh, yeah, my smog block off. I can get rid of all the emissions crap. And then we went with the dipstick temp gauge. So you know when the bike's warmed up. So this is pretty cool. We'll get this stuff going on there. I've been waiting for this bad boy. Uh, so we can get that bike all done. My old one had it, and uh, it was awesome. I, I gotta go in Jet Saras and get that uh, 158 jet coming. So when I get the exhaust, it'll be ready to go in this area and stuff. But yeah, so this will be good, little mod. As uh, I didn't post the video yet of me failing to put the gas tank on there, but I got a couple pieces of steel, stainless steel from work, that I'll uh, fab it up, and then I gotta just get the get the. Uh, Turn signal's all moving out of the way so I can get that thing to work on there. But yeah, that's where we're at, guys. Thanks very much. Talk to y'all later. So, got the XR only kit here. Get rid of the uh, smog stuff. And uh, there's different ones. You could get color coded ones if you look on eBay. And they're not, they might not be XR only, but all it is a couple block off plates. So, about to rip this crap off of here and get rid of this garbage. So, so we can have this bike free little fear freer goal for the days off here is to do my fab work got a couple of tabs to get the acabus take five gallon tank on there but i'm ready just to call it quits on that one for right now i'm gonna the ims four gal look at this it's got cobwebs because you got to move these out of the way a couple guys i watch a little bit too they put them in their little hand guards. i'm gonna get the actual ones that save you if you eat it these are just brush guards and uh but i haven't decided if i want to go that route yet and because this hits the tank because the tank's so big it, it'll hit it and you can't get a full full turn that's a that's a, you know that's a pot you want to be able to do that in your dual purpose so but yeah so we're sitting today and uh i'm gonna rip this part real quick Hopefully.
So after further investigation here, I do not have a California model car right where the light's at. There could be a little port coming out of there. I don't have a California model. And that you put one of your extra plugs, and then there's one down at the bottom. And I do not, like I said, I, this is not a California model, so I don't have to worry about plugging those two ports off the carb. But uh, this is the oil canister, and I'm, a I'm not 100% sure that comes off the top right here. If I want to take that off or leave it. So I might put it right back in the system and just plug my bottom port here. Because right now, if the way it's sitting, my transmission vent... It's supposed to be routed right to here, and you plug just that, and then we'd be done. But I don't know if I want, like, my oil catch can to just go right into the air box and let it get, like, oiled up and stuff. So I'm not 100% sure. I'm pondering that as we do this video here, but that's what's going down. Again, transmission vent for this the XR Only's kit, and it's the way the instructions read, I'm supposed to take the hose off the smog the f emissions stuff here take this part of this hose and route it from he here to the bottom of here I mean, you don't ever want to kink in it obviously because then it won't breathe and then you'll have oil come out your seals and be screwed so the way it sits the canister sits right here and then that would go to the top, so I'd take that top little plug out, put that all back in, and just plug the bottom of the port here. So I'm, I'm going to go look at something real quick again and decide what, what I want to do. I, I think I'm just going to put this back on there. What's, and it's not like I'm shaving weight here or nothing like that. I just it gave it some room to breathe, but I think I, I, don't, I want the catch, oil catch can up in there, and I don't want it. I'll try to keep this. You obviously put oil, you know, if you have like a... Uh, paper filters don't have oil on them but if you get like a uni filter it's got a little bit of oil to catch dust particles but if you're soaking the heck out of because you can see just from the 250 miles we got it's definitely doing its job so that that little bit of oil will be in the back of the air box and stuff so i think i'm just going to put it back together for the oil catch can and go from there but yeah i'll be back watching that punishing uh, smog lock off install <laughs> how not to do it looking good the plates in place right, like I said I put the cart charcoal canister back on and we do not have a California model so I didn't have to use my two extra plugs so I got some spares for future got this monstrosity off of here bike ready to go play next batch is to work on that big ass tank so Thanks, everybody, for watching. Have a blessed and safe day.